Hey guys, Sloppin Gaming here, and today we're back playing some more tabs, totally accurate battle simulator, and we've got face cam up. Now, I am an idiot because I thought I'll come on this game and I'll do the Renaissance, because the Renaissance um, classes came out, if you didn't know. As you can see, I've done three of them, because I thought I'd hit record. I had not hit record. So, I'm going to show you how I've done these ones. So, these are the painters. What I did was I had bone mages. I had one there, I had one there, I had one there, I had one there, and I had one at the back with a ninja right there. And this worked. Watch it not work this time. It should. Yep, it's looking like it was going the way it was. Okay, they killed them, yep, and then these two came along and got these ones. You want to use your final bit, man? Oh, right, there we go. So that's how I did that one. The next one, they have balloon archers. So shoot archers that make the make your guys, or if you have them, make the opposition fly away. They seem very good. We've got fencers and then painters who are the same as halflings in price. So what I did was I had a ninja, a ninja. This was my first attempt on this one, by the way, and I've managed to get through it. We had two berserkers to get in amongst the archers. And then what we had was just, just to confuse the archers, was a whole load of halflings. That's what we did. And it worked, quite convincingly. The berserkers got the archers quite comfortably, as you can see. So they're gone. And then the rest was done by the halflings and the ninjas. Pretty simple. What have we got now? This is where I got up to. I have not seen this one. The Renaissance, the Fencers, and Halberd. Okay, we'll just see how, how good they are. I mean, I just want to see if this works. If it does, it's a bit annoying, but... And then just put... And, oh, that's my phone. Ignore that, and then just put ninjas on the side, and... Uh, load of halflings at the back just to see what I'm sure that'll just run the thing straight up. These halberds are really good. Yeah, I thought that would happen. I did want to do that, but right, what have we got? Musketeers. Is that what that was? It was indeed musketeers. Fencing. Okay, okay. Very, very. Okay, I don't know. So they don't have any range. They guys are pretty strong. We've got 4,000. I mean, I think that's overkill. I think just an absolute shed load of potion sellers on the side. A whole load of halflings to take the hits. And then some berserkers to really get in amongst the people. I think that'll do it. They'll jump in, they'll destroy their own. The potion sellers will just confuse everybody as the halflings go for it. I mean, look at these berserkers. So, potion sellers are loving life. The halflings are really going at it. I think the potion sellers kill people. I mean, this is going rather, rather fishing. I, love, I think the potion sellers are better than the archers, if I'm being completely honest. I know they don't deal with like, lethal, they do deal with damage, but it's not like lethal lethal. But look at the range on them. They stay in a position, the reload time's great. We've won this. What? Honestly, potion sellers, 240, don't sleep on them. Right, so I'm, I'm just, I'm going to be boring here, and I'm just going to use potion sellers again, because they're so good. And I'm probably just going to put in an absolute shed load of ninjas. Uh, and obviously at the back, or at the front even, you've got to have your, your tribute hobbits. These are keep them at bay. Most of them. Ninjas just throw everything at the at them. Pretty simple, I think, with too much money. There's no chance for these guys. They have no range. They're all pumped up. How much have we got? 2002. Right, okay. These are the jousters. Okay. So for the jousters, I think Valkyrie will be the answer. One, two, one, two. And then we'll just have a load of halflings as bait. Yep, that one will. I mean, he's trapped. 
We're in the streets of Venice by the looks of things. Great. Is this really just what happened? Why did they just fall off the map? Why did they go into the water? I don't know. That seems very bugged. What have we got now? Pain? No. Wait, what are they? Just, uh, they're not on here. Are they a special unit? These must be a special unit that I've not seen that you can unlock. But I don't know what they do. But we'll soon find out. Uh, and if we're in doubt, you know what we use? We use potion sellers. Because potion sellers are the greatest thing that's ever been. Then what we're going to do is we're going to use berserkers. Lots and lots and lots of berserkers. And then what we're going to do is we're going to just fill the board with halflings. They'll jump in behind. These guys do that. They'll get the balloon archers. They're really actually quite annoying. What are these guys? They grab you and fly away. Drop you from great heights. Oh my word, they kill you with fall damage. Is that you? Oh, we won anyway, but... Okay, what is that Da Vinci tank? Right, okay, so the tank... What you would expect to be the play would be... I feel so terrible just going to potion sellers, but they're so good. And then putting the berserkers, because the berserkers just cause absolute havoc to any formation. And then we've got 200 left, so you know what we throw in? We throw in some half ones. The berserkers just get out there, they really do, they just, they just do their thing. The tank's really good, but everything's dead now. I think the berserkers got their job in the blast off room. Yeah, I think they've got this, because I don't know if that tank moves. I think it may be all the blast off. got some range, they've got, okay, what have we got? We have a lot of fodder for the, for the masses to shoot at. And then again, we go for brave, brave boys, the, these guys, because they just absolutely destroy. There we go, and we'll get another, I don't know. I think that'll be it. I think that will honestly do it. They will jump in, cause absolute havoc. The halflings will come in and sweep up the rest. At 250, 240, the berserkers and the potion sellers are insane. Look at that. I mean, they're just giving too much money. Jousters. Now they seem to want to go in the water, so... What do we do? Do we... Maybe harvesters are really good against these. I just gonna try a whole mm -mm. try a whole load of harvesters with that. I don't know if they'll be good. Can they reach up and grab slice them off the horses? Oh wow. Right, okay, that seems very good. Like very yeah, they can kill the horses in one slice. Harvester, so good thinking. Right, what we go? We're good. Okay, 8,000, that is so much. And in the back row, I think we go for some range. And the ninjas. I think that's it. I think that is it. They'll take out the main majority of the ninjas. Probably that's time to tell you. Because they've taken out all the muskets, all that are left of it. Yeah. Quite simple that. Right, what we, what is happening with him? He's, he's got a beat on. Right, we found out the harvesters do really well against these boys, so let's get three harvesters. Uh, the middle ones we found out berserkers are very good at berserking. We found out the potion sellers are absolute G's in general at holding people down. And then I think ninjas at the back are the way to go with some halflings just spread about to take the hits. I think they'll jump in, they'll throw. The harvester will get them. There's the horses down. Yeah, we've got that. 
Very nice. Two left, one left, there we go. Musketeers, I mean we've got 2,800, but that's very funny because all it's going to have is one for you, 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 and one for you. And then at the back, we will just have absolute or in front, sorry, we'll just have a load of you guys. You'll take, these guys will hopefully take the hit. And then that'll be it. They'll jump over, do their thing. Very easy, very, very. 2,800 is so much to give. Oh, wait. Oh, there's reinforcements, but we've got berserkers, so I think we're okay. Yeah, I think, I think we're still fine. Quite comfortably fine. <laughs> My god. That's quite cool, so they came in some downstairs. Oh, this might be difficult. Or will it? Do we just go for it again? Is that what we go for? With. You want little and more. You don't want one big person now, because they're going to get hit. So, we probably just want loads and loads of ninjas to come out at the end and just absolutely obliterate. I think that's what's going to They're going to do their jump, that jump is Look at that. with that. Whoa, 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 we've got stuff already. Right, we've got musketeers. We can only use something from the Renaissance. Here we go. 1,000 now. I don't know how good the painters are. Let's see how good the painters are. Are they better than half ones? What did they actually contribute to the whole thing? Right, they take the hits. They're very slow. But, oh, what the hell? Stab it, stab it. We're actually really good one on one. Oh, I think we've got that. Are they just, they're just normal archers, aren't they? Yes, they are. That's all they are. Normal archers. Press tab. Here we go. Right. Oh. Ah, so we've got to do it now with the Renaissance only. Oh, I think these boys are very, very well matched with just a load of painters. I think that will quite comfortable. Oh, the mage, oh, I forgot about the mages. It's how good people will see them. Oh, that's oh, spear floors, get away. They're not very accurate, are they? They're really not accurate. But when they hit, when they land the hit, they're fine. Oh. I'm running out of men here. Nice. Go on, little painter. Go on, little painter. Go on, little painter. Fifty for these painters. Say goodbye to the little half ones unless you want to slow something down. Right, four thousand for this. I think that's just set up for this, isn't it? With painters at the back, just in case it doesn't work. I think that's what this is set up for. Oh wow. Oh no, I don't think I've won this. Because these guys are the chieftain people. These are good. Right. Okay, okay, okay. I thought that was just set up for a joust. Right, okay. Musketeers. Yes, 
stagger the shooting with the musketeers. Very, very nice, right. These are spread out, these ones. What about just balloon archers? Absolutely everywhere. How good are the balloon archers? Wow. Wow, this is the reload time. Oh my word, the reload time and the balloon archers are insane. Right, watch that guy. Is every couple of seconds? That's about every four or five seconds, maybe five or six seconds. Oh wow, that's... And then fall damage is what kills them when they pop. That's, that's mental. It doesn't matter if you've got a shield, it just sticks to the shield. It takes them up anyway. It slows them down. The blue archers are the way. These are the future. The blue archers are the future. And I'm assuming the archers, the arrows do damage on top. <laughs> See you later. Oh, listen. Look at them all. Are they all just going for that boy? No, is he down? What, what, what is happening? Oh, what is happening? We try this again. Because something clearly happened. Right, so we're at this point, we're about to win. Let's see if they actually win this time. Or if they just end up going for the rest Well, I don't know if we're about to win. This is a bit tighter, this one. No, no, we're, did. we're good, we're good. Something happened. We've got just, just this on its own, really? The harvesters will take it out completely on its own anyway. I think a couple of musketeers, I think musketeers are really good. Oh wait, no. Sorry, we're the other side. I'm thinking we're this side. So we've got a jouster. And we've got to take out these. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to move these guys so much further back. In fact, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put the musketeers up here and here. I think that'll be the... Oh, that is how you do it. Look at that. You have them up here. Oh, don't fall off. You're fine though, you'll be safe. Oh, the, oh, the jouster's doing his bit. That's a kicking in the head. Look at this guy. Look at the jouster. Alright, we've got this. Easy. <laughs> the most all over the place jouster I've ever seen. <laughs> Is this what's happening? And he's going to come round and he's going to go over again. This is actually what I'm watching. Just shoot him. Shoot him. Just shoot him. Good man. What a shot. Look at that. Look at that arrow. Arrow. That bullet. Boom. Straight down. That's not very straight. But you know. Straight down. We're doing well. We're doing really well. I think we need two pay We need two double archers. I'm being honest with you, I think that would serve us really, really well. Um, let's pop one there so he doesn't take the damage and pop one there. And then we can get another painter in here because the painters are good. The painters are really good. I mean, I've already done this one. I mean, I should really just stick to the two musketeers, but I want to try other things. The painters try and take out the hobbits, we should really be dead at this point. Right here. Go on. Go on, little. Go on, boys. The hobbits are good because they just get taken away straight away. Oh, he's going he's to die. He's missed. Shoot the hobbits. Yes, the hobbits are getting done. Nice, 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 nice. He should be on his last health. As long as he just keeps on playing about with them. Oh my word. They're not very accurate though, that's one thing. The musketeers are nice and accurate. Oh, is he going in the water? Is he going to, is he going to get sucked away in the water? Go on. Yes, we've done it. Well done. <laughs> Goodbye, Harvester. That is it. Oh, wait, what? No, that's him. He's done. We've won it. So we've just got an army of these guys and we've got 1,000 left. What do we put? Do we just put an absolute load of painters? 
four shots. Okay, so they're not actually that strong. Right, they're all dead. So turn around, turn around. Oh, he's not dead yet. Turn around before the scarecrows get you all. I thought we could still do this. Just need time to die. Scarecrows are getting hit, yes. 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 My god. <laughs> These balloon archers are insane. Genuinely insane. Right, we've got a wee bundle there. Oh, it's just musketeers we can put. Right, so you've also got to have one that takes the hit. Then you're probably wanting to have... I don't know. Do you just want them spread out real nice? Is that how we're wanting to do this? Because I can't choose anything else. If I could, it'd be rather easy. Well, I need that first shot to take out a catapult. Catapult? A catapult. That first shot, I'm going to keep going until a catapult gets destroyed in that very first shot. Come on. Just too many of them. That is my problem. So, the question is what do you do? Do you put them all down here and then put up loads like that? Is that how you do it? They'll shoot. Then they'll just be shoot down there. You want to make it so that we can take them out real quick. So, what about. there and there. there we go. That could work. That could really work. Let's try that. But he, oh yes, yeah, so he takes out the catapult. They get close enough in, hopefully. We'll bring them out. Hmm. That's a lot better, though. Like, a lot better. So, yeah, the catapult goes through. Actually destroy one of these. Okay, there we go. That's destroyed. Right, how am I going to do this with only the musketeers? There's nothing you can do to beat this. There's nothing. If you can beat this, fair dues, but, so if you put just a line of people, right, and try and take out the catapults, I know I've had many of them, but they can't even hit it. The musketeers aren't actually that great. And you can also use them. There's one down, we've got one down, and then we need the second hit to hit the musketeers, not these guys, but they must, but look, they just take them out, and now it takes out all of them. Oh wait, maybe not. Oh my god, this could be the first time. Please take it out for us. Take it out. Yes. Go on, boys. This is the furthest we've ever got. Get out of the ranks. Get out of the masses. Take them out. Take them out. Take them out. Get close. Get close. Go on, boys. 
Oh my god. Are you kidding me? The, please. This is it. If they don't make it around in here anyway. If they make it, they make it. Go on. Go on. Go on, boys. They've done it. They've actually done it. In the final attempt. I just... You know how many times I've done that? Maybe 50 times? <clears throat> More? Are you having a laugh? I just put a straight line of musketeers. Oh, I've been at that so long and I've done that method about 10 times. That was a complete fluke. Watch, I'll show you. Well, I can. 5,000. Yeah, but we can use all of these and I'll show you how much easier it is now that you can use different things other than them. I may just carry on because to you guys, I think it's only been about 20 minutes. And I really want to finish this part. I'll do the medieval ones anyway. So this one and the next one. Um, I don't want the musketeers. I just don't. They're, they're, they're not good. And then we're just going to have an absolute unit of painters. See how much nicer it is just having more people. Look at the look at the balloon people. Actually look at how good the balloon people are. These guys had these instead of like musketeers, that would have been so much fun. Don't get musketeers, is what I'll tell you. Just get the balloon people. Look at them. These are kings, come on. And look, they're slowing them down. They're better than ice archers. I won't win this one, I don't think. Because I don't, these guys can't do anything, but... They're actually really good. It's the rate at which they fire. Right, so that's obviously... They're, they're obviously not going to fly away. Hold on. Is that you know what, boys? Go on, balloon archers. Look at them go, they're dropping down. They're backing off. If we can get them to fall into the water. There's one down here on his own. Alive. Keep going, keep going. Don't walk off, don't walk off, don't walk off, don't walk off. They're coming for you. If they can fall off into the... They were actually able to fall off into the water. Right, the problem there was the painters. The painters aren't good enough. The balloon people are insane. What about the halberd? Or, in fact, what about the da Vinci? How much do they actually have? Right, well, we'll, go. we'll get one of them there just to take out as much as we can. And then we'll just get balloon archers galore here. And then I think that best way. Boys are way too. Fall down. Oh. Well, oh, he's died. Okay. Give it more space by putting on this side. Da Vinci tank, and then have a balloon archers here. How does that work? He's got a tree this time. So can't just put it Oop. 
my gosh and this will be the last one because look at all of these I've done I've done all these my word this is the last one for today whoa right kings nothing but really now if this doesn't work with the staggered shooting then I don't know what will That's all I can see working, is standard shooting. Oh. Musketeers when you get them a big group, tell you what. It needs to be more staggered, they're so slow at reloading. Insane shot, mate. Right, guys. So I've been at this for so long. I'm sick of it. This is. A, I said this was going to be the final level. That was half. No, forty minutes ago. I've been at two levels for about an hour and a half in total. For what is this video? As you can probably see, there's a guy glitching in three. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to shoot as many of these as I can get. And this guy glitching in three is over water, so they'll all walk off and hopefully get him. I think my guy just fell on the ground. Hold on. There we go. Right. I'm hoping this boy can stay in this tree long enough so that he can just shoot them. And that I can cheese the game. So stay in the tree, stay in the tree. Good, they're all shooting. That's fine. Hopefully they all walk off their dead. This is the worst tactic I've ever seen in my life. And if it works, then great. Off they go. Like lemmings. Go on. Out you get. Out you get, and the guys fell out the tree. But hopefully, enough of them have gone now that I can destroy them. That is my hope. Please. If this tactic actually works, it is possible. But this isn't possible. I have to do the subject cheese again. But one more time. Please. Please just shoot him. Please just shoot him. Please just shoot him. Thank you for cheesing the game. I could not do that, Gillette. Gillette. Legit. It is infuriatingly difficult and yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that because I have spent one hour and 43 minutes recording. I have, well, can, I will continue these other ones in another video, I'll, I'll finish it off because oh my god, I might even cut some of these out, it's been that long. But if you guys enjoyed that, main menu first. But if you guys enjoyed that, uh, remember to comment, remember to like, and remember to subscribe. See you.